Rich Names is Cheaper and welcome to another video. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a survival house. So what you want to do, or the materials sorry, that you're going to need for this are oak wood logs, oak wood planks, oak wood fence, oak wood slabs, oak wood stairs, wooden trapdoors, torches and stone bricks. That's the materials to make the exterior. For the interior, um, you're going to need some more materials later on but I'll show you how to do that after we've done that exterior. So, you want to start by digging out a five, or go face the ground and then dig out five to the, to whatever direction you're building. So then, then then do a diagonal and then another, so I'm just checking that's five. Yep, that's five, cool. And then do another diagonal and then another five. And then another diagonal, then another five, and then another diagonal. Then you want to place oak wood logs in those holes that you've just dug out. Just fill that in with that material. There you go. And then fill that in. Cool. And then place oak wood slabs on top of the oak wood. So once you've done that, there you go. So then you want to dig this hole down by three, actually four because the logs, hold on, so just dig out the top layer of grass and then from the logs you want to dig down three, so one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, so you get the idea, just do that and then uh, I'll be back, I'm going to do that, so once you've dug out your hole you want to um, replace the uh, all the walls with your, you want to dig them back one. Actually, do this first. So the corn, so the diagonals, you want to bring the liquid log, liquid log down to the ground. So do that on all four corners, and then once you've done that, you want to dig it, dig all the sides back by one. But you want to leave one, you want to, after you, okay, I'll explain in a second. So then what you want to do is fill them in with, am I doing that right? Yeah, yeah. So you just want to fill that in with, um, no I'm not, you want to dig the back one again, sorry. So you want to, um, Dig them back one and then fill in the walls like this. And then after you've done that, you want to place uh, oak wood slabs along the um, along the top like that. So it just gives it a bit more depth, I guess. Minecraft depth. So you want to do that on all four walls. Nothing is working for me today. There you go. And then you want to do that, and then one, and then the last wall. So there you go, nearly done. Cool, and then place your oak slabs along the bottom of the logs like that. So, and then you want to fill in the floor with stone bricks. So just take out the entire floor and then after you've done that you want to choose one wall to be your staircase into the build because you don't have any way to get in and out. I mean you have a way to get in, you don't have a way to get out though. So just fill all this in with stone bricks. Because oak and oak wood log, or you could fill it in with any material that you want. You can change out all these materials. These just work the best, in my opinion. Right, so choose one wall to be your um, staircase. So you want to break out. So uh, once you've chosen the wall, break out the oak wood logs, then place your stairs 
uh, one block behind the logs. So then just take out the hole to just form a staircase by going up one every time. There you go. Then after you've done that, you want to bring, you want to get your logs and actually you want to do a, so you want to bring them out like this. So you bring four, but you just want to do a layer or a, um, what is it called? Just put your oak wood logs along or behind the, um, behind the oak wood slabs. You want to do this and then put fences on top to make it somewhat sort of mob proof. Mob, mob proof. So just make like a barrier of fences. There you go. And then you want to knock out these two blocks and then replace them with slabs. And then knock out these two blocks and replace them with slabs. And then, and then um, place a awkward, awkward log in front of them like that and then go in block, go in one block and then place and then in one block and then place. And then you just, that's going to be your door or your three doors. And then after that you just want to place some... Um, why did I do that three high? Sorry guys, give me a second. So then you just want to do this and then put a row of oak wood slabs above them. And I use trap doors to form the entrance or to form the doors because it's cooler. Uh, if it actually works. There you go. So just, you can just use regular doors if you want. I just use this because it's cool. And then just fill in this, like, and then fill in the rest of the dirt with oak wood. You're gonna need a lot of oak wood for this build. Go. So that's basically the exterior. So you just got your big hole in the ground like that. And then for lighting, you can just place uh, torches on the top of the oak wood logs, like this. Oh wait, there's one more thing that you need to do, and that is bring your stairs across like this bring your open slabs along like that to just form like a whatever this is. Can I put fence? Uh, okay. Well that's basically the exterior so let's let's do the interior so I'm just gonna grab the blocks that you need and then come right back. So for the interior you're gonna need any type of bed, um, a chest, an ender chest, a crafting table, a furnace, a brewing stand, cauldron, anvil and some water. This this house can fit, or this house can fit more than or two people. So then you can put chests. So then you want to put your bed, and then a bed, and then a chest, and a chest. And then you can put torches above it if you want, because it looks nice. So then you want what am I doing? There you go. So then on this side, you want to place two furnaces on either side, then two chests. And then a crafting table. Then for the other side, you just you want to place uh, your cauldron, and then fill it up, and then an anvil on this side. And we'll place it that way because it looks cooler. And then get your ender chest and place it there. And then dig out this four by four area. I'll come down here and then replace it. You don't, you just, I'm just going to replace it with wood, because why not, or stone, because I guess stone makes more sense. You just replace this area here with stone, because you're going to make an unlimited water source, so you can, um, you can make your potions and stuff. You can fill this in one again, so you make it one high. You're going to need your trapdoors again, actually. Can I just put that in there like that? No, I just put, I just drowned the whole thing. And then there you go. So there's your unlimited water source, and then you can. I think it's unlimited. I don't know. You can check if you want. I'm, I really don't wanna. And then put your and then put a trapdoor there, and then put your brewing stand on top of your ender chest like that. 
then you don't need anything so just clear it and then you want to get some soul sand some glowstone and then some nether wart where's the nether wart where's nether wart there's nether wart right so then you want to knock out this block here then place a glowstone and then put soul sand and then nether wart and that's basically your house you don't need it, you can put torches in between there like that, and then one there like that. So that's your house. All finished and done. Actually, there's one thing that we missed on the staircase. Which is... To just give it, to just make it look cooler. So you want to get your materials back, if you put them in your inventory. If you didn't, then grab them again. And then just knock out these blocks. Replace them with oak wood logs and then put fences all the way up to the slabs. And there you go. That's your house. And um, yeah. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please do remember to leave a like and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. Boy. <laughs>